Hello and welcome to another Let's Play. This is the demo for Chiyo, a Japanese horror game where we play as a paranormal investigator who possesses supernatural abilities. And we are tasked with investigating an abandoned mansion and uncovering the dark family secrets that are in there. But as we do so, someone or something is watching us. Investigator Hidate Chiyo. Few reports from Gatsu Iwami province view that there is a high level psychic disturbance coming from a small mountainous area east of the town. The source of the disturbance appears to be a localized anomaly, a swirling cloud vortex just above the area. Its thick tendrils blocking out the sun, casting everything below in a gray, foggy shroud. Preliminary investigations indicate that the appearance of this anomaly coincides with the strange going on within the Honeyman family grounds a few weeks back. Townsfolk residing nearby have spotted people believed to be a part of the Honeyman household leaving the Honeyman mansion in small groups in the early hours of the morning on horseback encumbered with heavy bags and chests. After the departures stopped, the townsfolk started spotting ghostly apparitions wandering aimlessly within the Honeyman family grounds. And hearing mournful cries and eerie wailing carrying across the air in the darkness of the night and in the gray pall of the day. I task you, Investigator Idate Chiyo, with investigating the source of the psychic disturbance. Ascertain whether it is connected to the cloud vortex or any ongoing supernatural activity, and put to rest any disturbances you might find. Remember your training. I will pray to the Kami for your success. Amater and Sue will protect you. Grandmaster of the Shogunate's Magical Arcane Division, Matsumoto Tensai. All right. There's a literal intro. Okay. To illuminate. Oh, that's cool. Eat to hold near curse items to cleanse them. Does that work? Let me try this again. Okay, so you just had to hold it. Alright, but before we check in there, let's see what's over here. someone was like running up on us I like how like instead of a flashlight we're just using our abilities that's pretty cool okay so this open the doors open kind of like uh the amnesia game okay and here's where we sounded like we heard people running child's homework Looks like a child's handwritten homework. Can we investigate? Okay. Interesting. Uh, let's see what else is over here. Don't look like anything there we can interact with. Alright, so that's where we were on the other side of and where we heard the footsteps. Um, I don't have anything for that. 
All right. The letter was, I'm assuming, from the, the opening, yeah. My beloved flower, remember our engagement this evening with mother? I know she could be daunting, but please give it time for my sake. I saw this lovely chest on my trip, and I could not resist. I gift to you to hold with all that is precious, as I hold you in my heart. The lock is set to the date when I first laid my eyes on you. Yours, Sujiro. Okay, so I'm assuming that's what the answer to that is. So the first time that I set my eyes on you. I don't think we have the answer for that just yet. Alright, there's talismans blocking that door. Uh, okay. Let's see what's over here. Anything? Okay. What's this? Pick the bruised fans. A delicate paper fan painted with an elegant, understated decorative motif. Huh. Okay. Anything else? Doesn't seem right. Doesn't seem right. Okay, so something has to go here. What's this? Note from Yota is recorded. Come on, click this one. Oh. That's the one that we want. Note from Yota. Mother, as you requested, I met with the Osho and had him bless the gong. However, the gong's power to repel spirits dissipates after one use. The Osho apologized for his lack of skill with spiritual abjuration and helped and hope that his shortcomings will be overlooked yota okay if i ever like butcher words i apologize i have like speech issues <laughs> like legitimately i have speech issues i went to speech therapy and oh how do we get rid of this There we go. Yeah, I have speech issues, and uh, English is also not my first language, or at least it's not the first language that I've learned. And I learned it from two people who themselves learned it as a second language. So some of my pronunciations can be pretty lame. <laughs> Listen closely. There, the muffled clacking of a pair of geta echoing across the halls. Okay. I mean, we did hear footsteps earlier. There we go. Open up that door as we check in here. What's this? Intricate writing box. We finally lacquered. Writing box with intricate detailing and an exterior featuring soft stylized artwork. Can we open it? No. Okay. What's this? Air pin. Finally crafted and lavish detailed hairpin. Wonder if you can select that, combine the two. Doesn't look like it. Oh, am I supposed to guess the the, the order for this? Did I get it right?
so. No, I don't think so. Uh, I'll come back to that. Okay, I need a key for that. Ah, Nori mask. Picked up an angry mask. And a happy mask. Ah. Uh, why is there blood stains? Hi. Okay, nothing else I can see here. Are the masks supposed to go on? No. I mean, they could. Huh. Well, I'm not going to inspect that right now. Let's see what else we got around here. Okay, this opens. And that's locked. Okay, that's where we came from. Uh, we put masks? You could put the masks there as well. Hi. Okay, the Bruce fan. Delicate paper fan painted with an elegantly understated direct, uh, decorative motif. Okay. Is there another item I missed? Right here. Home to my love. Mother, as you requested, I met with the Osho and had him bless the gong. However, the gong's power... Yeah, I already said that. There we go. To my wife, Owen, I present to you these tokens of love as an emblem of our vows. A whispering breeze captures the sea's eternal struggles where the majestic koi tames the surging azure might. On your crown, an ornate red and gold blossom, weaving whispers of grace into the tapestry of her continence. In the eternal glow of moonlight, two pair of eyes fix their gaze on the golden canvas above, writing celestial secrets among the constellations. The crafted visage caught in the everlasting expression, mirroring the joy that eludes confinement. Okay. So joy. Um... Uh, the eternal glow of moonlight. Two pair of eyes fix their gaze on the golden canvas. Moonlight. This one? Moonlight, two gazes? That's, yeah, I'm guessing that one. On your crown, an ornate red and gold blossom guessing this one this goes this is a hair painting yep and then what was the first one a whispering breeze catches the sea's eternal struggle with a majestic koi I'm guessing this one maybe it seems like the sea Let's see, what's this one? The Majestic Koi? I mean, well, let's try it. There we go. I don't like that noise. Jiro's Diary. Uh, year to July 13th. Today my family has finally come to a decision. They are letting me participate in the yearly diplomatic conference. As the youngest son of the family, this will be an opportunity for me to showcase my abilities and to prove to them that I am just as worthy as my three elder brothers. If I succeed, I will be rewarded with the prestigious family crest emblem, a symbol of my family's glory. 
This will be acknowledgement that I am a worthy member of the Hans Aiden house. This is a huge task for me. I do not want to disappoint them. I am determined to prove myself. When I was wandering the streets today, I met a girl. People told me she's the new Tayo in town. She sang a song I didn't recognize. Her voice was enchanting. Uh, our eyes met and she smiled at me, sweet and tender, like a spring breeze. Her voice now lingers in my mind, her smile in my heart. I might go see her again. No, I will go sh see her again. I wonder what her name will be. On Aiden Sojo. Alright, so this is the first time that they met eyes. So 2 July 13th. this picked up the rope something else I gotta pick up what happened I got got did I die uh Okay. And there is an item for me to go grab over there. Am I allowed to go grab it? Oh, hey. What's up? Where'd you go? Well, we got the gong. We know where the gong goes. Gong goes here. Ah. The mallet. The mallet to play the gong. But before we do that... We go downstairs? Where's the downstairs? It disappeared. Yeah. I think it disappeared. Let me see if I can find it. gone. It should be right here. Alright, well, let's go play this gong. Hi. He downstairs. Oh, this opened up. We can go check downstairs now. Okay. Well, that's the thing. Let's just ignore that. Uh, oh, it was inside there. Okay. So the dates... It was... Uh, year 2, July 13. Oh, how am I supposed to... Wait a second. Okay, here we go. Uh... Okay. So, that's how we do the symbols. So, it was... July 13th, year 2. July 13th, year 2. July 13th, year 2. July 13th, year 2. So year 2, so would it be that? 
And July is the seventh. So it'll be equal sign T dash three dash. Equal sign. B dash three dash. Yep, we got it. All right, we got the key. All right, so it was the key for. Got to be for upstairs, one of the doors. Not missing anything. Hi. This door? Door is locked. Not that one. Okay. Here we go. All right, what's on the other side? Hi. What the? Hey, well. What's up, spooky ghost? Oh, you're gone. A lot of blood here. I hope this is not Chris's blood. Okay. We got God again. Thank you for playing. <laughs> so that's the demo. Okay. I, you know what? I, I like it so far. Kind of simple and stuff, but I, I like these like Japanese horrors with a lot of like the Japanese aesthetics and stuff. Uh, that one last puzzle kind of like confused me for a while. I thought like it was one of those where like you had to know Japanese, and then you don't know how, you don't want to know how long it took me until I remember like, hey, we picked up a children's homework page. Just that's got to mean something, right? And then I saw the numbers, and I was like, oh, okay, that's how you match them up. So there you go. There's a demo for Chio. I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, hope to see you next time. Take care. Later.